Stormy Cloud 21 here today. I've got something amazing to show you. This is the Kitchen Encounter Pack. Jurassic World Legacy Collection. Here's the UPC right there. This is an amazing set because not only do we get Timmy right here, but we get Lex finally. And there's Lex with that frying pan from the kitchen. And there we have a Jurassic Park Raptor right there. And it also has a scan code from the top with the DNA, really cool. And you can look in there and you can see pots and pans everywhere and a fan. And there is the steel countertop that the Raptor is upon, which is of course made out of cardboard. Really cool that we finally have a Lex figure. So looking forward to opening this. So I'm gonna flip it on the back of the box. And on the back of the box, here is that Velociraptor. Again, there's Lex Murphy, Tim Murphy, brother and sister, the frying pan. And then here is some information scanning to unlock the DNA, very cool stuff. Here is a look at the top of the box. And then underneath as well. Here is a look at the side of the box. And here is a look at the other side. And my razor crest is in the way back there. And now I'm going to open up this soon and check it out with you. So now opening the box, I'm sliding out the set and the Raptor bit the dust. Boom. You can see it is not tie strapped in the packaging. Now oh, here is that Raptor's eye painted on there. Not bad at all this time. How about the other side? Not good at all. And then the mouth has articulation. The head can turn, can go forward and back. The arms like this, but not out. The legs, they go back, forward, back, forward, and then over here, you can pull this up and get a picture of the Jurassic World logo. And then flipping the figure over, I look at that DNA scan code, slides back in there in the dinosaur, like so. Really wish that eye was a lot better on this side, but this eye is near perfect over here, so I'm glad with that. The coloration is very good for a raptor that was in the very first movie. Then here we have Tim and Lex. I'm going to pull Tim off of here. And now here is Tim, and this is the same exact Tim as we got before with the Ford Explorer, except that his clothes have dirt and his leg has dirt and his arm has dirt right there. But this is really cool. Very good likeness of the figure of Tim Murphy. Very cool stuff. And now, and now here is our Lex Murphy figure. 
highly anticipated for this to happen. All you fans from all the years have waited for this moment. We had always wanted a Lex Murphy figure, and now we finally got one. There's the information on the back. The head articulates, the arm articulate up and down or forward. But there is no elbow articulation. The legs can do the splits and the knees. You can swivel there at the knees or bend the knees. Also, she has some dirt on her jeans as well as some dirt right there on her arm and up there on her shoulder. That is the Lex figure. And I'm going to get out the frying pan. Now here is the frying pan. And what more to go better with a kitchen set. And now interestingly enough, this is not the only frying pan I own. This one that I own is from the Indiana Jones stuff that came out a long time back. And this is the one that I've now got today that goes very well with it. So now I have another kitchen utensil, you might say. And now when you take this out of here, you can see here you have this kitchen. And if you look right back of there, you can see the raptor peering through the window, fogging up the glass, just like in the movie so many years ago. All these boxes underneath here. And now this is just cardboard, just, you know. But you could recreate the scene minus this extra stuff in your way. It looks very cool. 2021. So then I'm going to set this up. Lean against the Razor Crest. And there you have it. There is the kids sitting there hiding on the edge of the steel cabinet with the raptor above. And then here is a frying pan. Right there, cool stuff. And so here is a comparison of Tim Murphy, the new versus the old. And you can see really it's just the dirt. Other than that, looks exactly the same figure. And the first Tim figure came with these night vision goggles. So feeling fortunate to have this set a little early, not very much early, about three days early. And I just want to say, you have not because you asked not. I asked and now I have, and I'm glad that I have. And this was an item that I had pre-ordered and now that I have it, there is obviously no need to pay that much money. So I am glad to have canceled and be able to have this now and to save a little money off the cost. So I am glad to have this set. Could I see myself owning more than one? Maybe just more than one, maybe to get a second Raptor, but or second Lex, but the point is I'm satisfied with what I have here. So probably no need to get another. I'm just thankful. So this is Stormy Cloud 21. Thank you for watching this review. Please remember to hit that like and subscribe button to see more cool stuff coming up soon. Thank you for watching. And talk soon.